Welcome aboard a sunny flight over South America. If you are flying the A320 in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024 and have a Stream Deck Plus, this profile with free pilot stack blocking is going to take your plane controls to the next level. Simply download my profile, add it to your Stream Deck and you are good to go. The download link and more details are in the description below. Now let's jump into the demo. The first page is all about navigation and radar controls. With the first knob you can easily adjust the parameter value. Pressing it switches between standard and normal mode, while the touchscreen lets you change the parameter units on the fly. Next up, the second knob controls the navigation screen mode, allowing you quickly switch between ADF-1 and VOR-1 with just the press. The third knob works similarly but for ADF-2 and VOR-2 and turning it lets you adjust the range. For terrain, you have a dedicated button to toggle it on and off, but unfortunately this feature isn't functional in the sim at the moment. However, all the other buttons let you fine-tune the display details to your preference. The radar controls are also right at your fingertips. You can turn the radar system on or off with a single button, while the forward knob gives you full control over the captain display radar mode. Pressing the knob switches between different radar settings, turning mimics the selected radar unit knob. The touchscreen makes adjusting the radar mode smooth and intuitive. Moving on to page 2. Here is where you find everything you need for autopilot control. You can easily switch between Mac and Nots and toggle between vertical speed and flight path angle mode depending on your flight needs. The knob gives you full control over speed and altitude with an option to change the altitude increment between 100 and 1000 feet. Heading and vertical speed adjustment are just a turn away and the knobs also replicate real-world autopilot functions. Pressing a knob mimics the pull function, which selects manual control while tapping the touchscreen mimics the push function, enabling managed mode. This setup makes managing autopilot setting feel much more like interacting with the actual A320 systems. Page 3 is dedicated to landing gear and braking systems. Here you can easily control anti-skid, brake fan and auto brake levels with just a tap. The landing gear buttons are placed at the top, not only allowing you to raise and lower the gear but also displaying their current position in real time. It's a simple but essential setup to help you manage your landing with ease. And that's a quick look at my A320 Stream Deck Plus profile. If you found this useful, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out the future updates. I'll be adding more content soon, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next flight.